It's said often, in the context of many sports, we need to grow the game. Well, the Robert Morris University men's hockey team puts those words to work every summer at their annual youth hockey camp held at the Island Sports Center. Well, I think it's important that we um, transfer our knowledge to young hockey players. I think young hockey players are the, are the future of our game and the future of our fan base. It's the future of our community. So we need to make sure that uh, you know, we get out there and get a chance to teach the kids a little bit and make sure the kids do a, um, learn as much about hockey as they can. The Colonials conduct this camp every July, bridging the gap between seasons for the young hockey players in the area. But not only does this camp develop the skills of the local youngsters, it also gives RMU hockey players a chance to give back. Well, I think they get to start learning a little bit about coaching. Um, they start to learn about teaching. They start to learn about working with young kids as well. And uh, all these kids are no different than the kids in our hockey camp, all of our players, because they at one time come from different areas that want to strive to be a Division I hockey player. They may want to be a Division I player, they may want to play club hockey, they may want to play um, even just after high school and junior hockey. So they are a chance for them to talk to these young kids about playing at the next level. While Pittsburgh has made huge leaps in terms of grassroots hockey growth over the past decade, having local youngsters work with college players from all over North America can inspire them to stick with the sport. Yeah, it's awesome. There was a lot of people when I was younger that helped me out. Helped me out. So, you know, it's good to just be able to help them out. And, you know, help them reach their goals. Finally, let's not forget that Pittsburgh area talent has helped propel the Colonials program to great things in NCAA hockey. Schooley and his staff want to make sure it stays that way. Hockey's getting better in Pittsburgh. We see that with the amount of high-level Pittsburgh kids we've had on our team. Our two of our last three captains have been from, from Pittsburgh. We had Brendan Jamison and Colin Salt. We've got uh, our returning leading scorer, Zach Lynch, from Pittsburgh. So we've got a good group of kids that have come out of the Pittsburgh area. And uh, it's only going to get better and better. And we want to keep the best kids at home. So this is, back to your other question, this is a little bit of a significant thing for us just to promote our program a little bit within the community. For RMU Athletics, I'm Matt Geitka.